Hi everyone, this is Bernard Bertrand, director, photographer and Lumix ambassador. On this quick tip, I'm going to talk about the continuous autofocus. I always been putting focus manually for years, but since the Lumix S camera lineup, I admit to use the AFC a lot, if not all the time, and especially on the body and face detection mode. And this is exactly what I did use to shoot those images. So let me tell you more about that AFC function and the way I'm using it. First of all, AFC means continuous autofocus, which means that when you are recording a moving subject, the focus will stick with it. But then you have to choose from many different autofocus mode. And this is done by pushing this button and you will then see the IF mode menu. I personally often use this 225 area mode and this will form a 225 area grid where your focus will track your subject. But then there is the intelligent one. All the way to the left, you will find that human shape. This is the face eye body detection. And this is the one I'm using all the time. This mode will recognize the eyes, the face, the full body, or even half of a body. This is actually the mode I'm using right now on my S1H. And for example, in those images, when I'm passing from the face of the boxer to the end of the boxer to capture insert shot like this one, the IF mode automatically switch back to the 225 area. And it doesn't mean that you are moving from here to here into the IF mode menu. No, it just means that if the IF intelligence cannot track an eye, a face or a body, into your image, it will not let you down. And it automatically switch to 225 area mode in order to keep focus on your subject. And as soon as you get a human face or body into your frame again, it will snap back on it automatically. I really love it. And if your camera detects many faces or many person on your shot, it will highlight a yellow box around the face that is the one that will be tracked by the continuous autofocus. And the other faces will also get a box, but those will be white. And that means that those other faces could also be your main subject, and this will depend on your choice. If you want to move from one face to the other, you simply have to push on this joystick, and the yellow box around the face will change face, and this goes from left to right. And same thing if your camera sees many body shapes on your shot, or different faces and body shapes. Simply push the joystick to switch the yellow box around your main subject. On another video, I will talk about the IF custom setting for not being too long on this one. But the continuous autofocus set face on body and face detection is what I did use for those shots. And as you see, I was asking my model to go in and out of that really narrow ray of light. So he was literally getting out of darkness. And as soon as it get into the light, my focus was spot on. I love that functionality. And one last note about this intelligence autofocus function is that it also can track animal shapes, a dog, a bird, a cat. You simply have to select it here on your screen. From there, you will get a bird symbol next to the human body shape logo. And if there's any animal on your shot, you will also find a box around the animal's body. So I can assure you that once you'll test that function, you will use it a lot, like I do. I will see you on the next video. Thank you very much and see you next time. Panasonic.